Well, Governor, you say you, uh, that voters want somebody, a leader, who will stand up. Uh, a few days ago, I saw you asked uh, right here on Fox about this Confederate flag issue down in South Carolina, and you basically punted and said it's a state issue. Is that leadership? No, I didn't punt at all. I just simply said that the president of the United States has nothing to do with what flags go on as uh, capital grounds. Look, I think that we've missed the, the real point of this. And when I'm asked that question as a presidential candidate, what I'm being baited for is, is South Carolina a racist state? And so what I said was, Ed, if as a frequent visitor to South Carolina, I look at this objectively, you've got uh, a female governor who is of Indian descent. You have the only elected African-American U.S. senator in the South from a state of 4.8 million people elected largely by people who are mostly white. Mm -hmm. That's not racism. And okay. so the, the flag is an important issue for South Carolina, but I don't think the president of the United States needs to be picking the symbols that fly on state capital grounds. Fair it wasn't point. a punt. I didn't squirm. I didn't uh, vacillate on it. Fair point. But now that Republican governor has spoken out and it has said that it is an awful yes. symbol and she wants it to come down. Do you agree with her? Yes or no? Absolutely, because that's where it needed to be settled. She took leadership of her state, and that's what governors do. Uh, she was accompanied by the congressmen, by the senators, by the leaders of the House and Senate. Uh, that's where this issue should be, and it is being settled. It shouldn't be settled by the New York Times or a bunch of talking heads <laughs> from uh, a Washington roundtable. It ought to be decided by the people who live in that state. That's what's happening, and I salute Governor Haley and... Uh, the other people of South Carolina are saying, look, if, if this is a distraction, if this is uh, something that inflames people, it's not that important to us. What's more important is a state where we can create the kind of atmosphere that we saw out of the church members of Charleston. And I keep hearing that people talk about we need more conversations about race. Actually, we don't need more conversations. What we need is conversions, because the reconciliation that changes people is not a racial reconciliation, it's a spiritual reconciliation when people are reconciled to God. We saw it in those church members. When I love God, and I know that God created other people regardless of their color as much as he made me, mm -hmm. I don't well, have a problem with racism. It's, and, it's solved. And out of this awful tragedy, you are certainly right. There has been a very uplifting symbols coming out of that church and people rallying around them. Governor Mike Huckabee, thanks for joining us this morning. Thank Next. you, Ed. Great to be here. Good to see you.